Welcome to Chaley Warren. Uh, it's just under three hectares and it's one of our oldest owned uh, nature reserves. We uh, first bought the site back in 1967. It, it's, it's been a site um, where access has always been a problem. In fact, there's no legal right of access to the site. So we've always struggled with um, management. However, uh, over recent years, through the help of our neighbours, we've uh, been fortunate enough to gain access um, informally just for management purposes and we're able to drive in now and we're able to walk in throughout the year which has been very useful. It's enabled us to carry out uh, considerable management uh, which has been amazing. Over the last five years we've reintroduced uh, pony grazing and cattle grazing to the site and we've, in combination with the control of bracken and the control of birch, uh, we've managed to really turn the site around from a site that um, really was struggling. Originally bought for marsh gentians. Um, our last recorded marsh gentian was in 2011. However, uh, thanks to the Millennium Seed Bank and Kew Gardens, we have uh, been fortunate enough to work in partnership with them to actually recolonise the site with a suite of plants, not just marsh gentian, but um, a suite of plants to re-establish and turn Chaley Warren around. Now we've got the management in place, we can get these plants growing, we can re-establish the marsh gentian population for the site and, um, and going forward, so I hope that um, with the continued management and with the goodwill of our neighbours, the site will just get better and better and better. I think what is really nice is that the marsh gentians that we're actually replanting were actually originally collected from Chaley Warren. So there's a full circle there. Seeds from the marsh gentian population were collected, they were taken to Kew and stored, and now they've been, uh, they're being regrown at Kew, Wakehurst Place, and then we're re-transplanting them back on site, and that's a really fantastic turnaround.